Hello, hello, my lovely booze. I got a video for you guys. I'm going to be using the Gershon Poly Gel. This is their clear poly gel that I didn't get to review for you guys. I would like to review this because I didn't review this in the last video, but I'm also going to be using their clear dual forms. I'm going to be using their poly gel tool from Gershon. And I'm going to be using their base coat as well. And I'm using 75% alcohol. Um, and guys, don't forget, Gershon has uh, been graciously offered a 15% discount code on the Gershon products. So check that down below in the description box. I will also have their kit um, down below as well. So that way that you can check it out. But let's go ahead and start applying. This is their base coat, guys. I am going to forewarn you, they are in brown bottles, so transparent brown bottles. So please make sure that if you're using this product, that you are not using it around a UV LED light or a ring light. So, alright guys, I'm just going to go ahead and apply this to all my nails and I will be right back. You do want to make sure that you prep your nails and you want to make sure you push back all of your cuticles. It smells so good guys. Their base coat smells amazing. I don't know why but it does. It smells so good. I feel I'm going to like make a mess. I already have my forms sized up already before I even started because I didn't want to have to take time to, um, you know, get those ready and everything. So I did go ahead and size them up. Now you can apply just one layer if you like, and if you don't like, you know, you can apply two. Just all depends on you. I normally just apply one, one layer. Make sure that you don't get this in your skin at all. Go around and make sure, make sure there's nothing in the, your skin. And you also want to make sure that you're covering all areas. Sometimes I have the tendency to miss this spot because where my nail's not turned around. You do want to get up there as close as you can. That looks really good. So, okay. I think I might have cut that one just a little too close.
bottoms are okay. I actually like the dual forms. They're not that bad. But I absolutely love how easy this spreads down the dual form. Like, it does so good. So, so good. I mean, it really does. Like, out of most poly gels that I've used, this is probably about one of my favorites. It's just so easy. It doesn't stick. You can easily move it. I mean, and it stays where you put it. So literally, like, and it's it's not hard to move at all. You can make it as thick as you want in there. You can look. You can even roll it up. It doesn't even stick to the um, form. Like that's amazing. I've had them to where you know you go to like lift the product inside. The if you don't know, Gershon was gracious enough to give me a 15% code for you guys. That way if you're interested in this poly gel set that you can go and order it for 15% off. Really amazing. It'll be linked in my description box for you guys so that way you can check it out and order you this poly gel kit because believe me, don't miss out guys because this, this poly gel is amazing. But I'm going to show you something really cool here too. Now a lot of times when I'm encapsulating something inside of dual forms, I usually have to put like a really thin layer and then I put what I want in it and then all of a sudden I go back and add more. Add more poly gel because that way um, it'll be fully encapsulated. So, let me show you because I'm really ecstatic right now. Okay, so I ordered these from AliExpress, and they're just little shards of Mylar, which is amazingly beautiful. They're blue. I love it. So I'm so ready for Christmas now. I love Thanksgiving and everything, considering that my birthday is this month. But, um, anyways, when you're laying these shards, you want to lay them to where they're in the middle of the poly gel. Because you don't want, you still want product to lay on your nail. That way you don't get like lifting or nothing like that. But anyways, let me see. I'm just picking out little tiny small pieces that I like. And I'm just laying them super tiny small pieces, guys. Just tiny, 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 tiny pieces. There's little dark blue ones and then there's these. But I am trying to get a little bit of the blue ones in there too. That way it has a different assortment of color in it. It's so pretty. These were only like 68 cents on AliExpress. Well worth having. Because there is so much of it. You know what I mean? There's like literally look. That's the bag right there. And there's so much in there. I'm putting it all to the middle here because you want to, you know, you want to put a little, enough in it. But you also have to make sure, like I said, do not get it up on those sidewalls because what happens is when you cure, the paper will actually stick out from the um, poly gel. But anyways, okay. So that looks like enough to me. Actually, probably too much, but it's okay. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take my poly gel and I'm just going to lift it because, like I said, this poly gel just doesn't stick to the inside like some do. And I'm just going to like lift it. Now on this part, I'm going to leave it like that, but I'm going to start pushing it down inside the poly gel, okay? Just push it down and pull over. Pull over the rest of it. Now you can literally spread this all the way up. It's that great. Just fold it over on the inside of it and start pressing it back down. So you don't have to keep re-adding poly gel to your dual form or nothing like that. And it is completely inside of my poly gel now. Pretty cool. That is awesome. 
Thank you, Gershon. You have done very well with this set. I absolutely adore this set. I really do. Um, you, it has everything in it to do a full mani. Um, I'm very excited. I have um, I am have their dip powder set coming soon. So I would do a full review on that. And I'm excited to see their dip powder. Hopefully, I will get to review their thermal poly gel. I absolutely want to try their thermal poly gels. But guys, really take advantage of that 15% code. Go over there, get you some poly gel. Use that 15% code, save some money. You will not regret it, I swear. See, now it's all on the inside. I'm just going to make sure that it, it is... You want to make sure there is enough poly gel, though. You don't want it really thin. Just going to make sure I pull this down all the way. I want it up on the sidewalls there a little bit. Not all the way, because I am pushing that down. Alright, see how awesome that is? And it's all on the inside of it. That's amazing. Pretty cool. Alright guys, I will be back. Oh yeah, oh guys, I meant to tell you though, take advantage while you can on that, that code though guys, because it's only good until the 20th of this month. After the 20th, it will not work anymore. Hopefully, uh, maybe Gershon will give me a permanent code for you guys, or one that, or whenever they run one, I can always add it to my videos. But yeah, it's only good until the 20th. Don't forget. If you if if so, it'll it'll be gone. Make sure you use it. Way too much alcohol in that one. Sorry, that was my fault. I really like these. I like how they're tapered too. Like the and what I mean by tapered, I'm gonna show you real fast. So on these dual forms, as you can see, it's really wide on this end, and then it comes in, and then it goes straight forward, which is really amazing because most dual forms are just flat. I mean, not flat, but they're just like one, one way. But these are actually extended to like actually fit your nail bed. Really, really great. Alright guys, so I'm back and I've got all these done. So excited. I'm going to be using the Manicura. And let me see. I do have 
If I can find them here, I do have some rhinestones or little pixie crystals that I'm going to be using if I can find them without dropping stuff everywhere. Alright guys, so I added two coats of the manicure. Now, what I'm going to do here is a little fascinating. But I'm actually taking, going to take some of the Gersian Poly Gel just in clear. And this is how I get my rhinestones to stick. But what I want to do is I want to take just a tiny bit, just like that. Not really enough to misshape the nail or anything like that. And anything that is, you have to extra save it for any other rhinestones that you are going to be using. So let's go ahead and take our poly gel tool. And I'm taking a little bit of acetone here. Sorry guys, I forgot my lint free wipe. Let's see. Okay. Lint free wipe. Blot it off. And spread this all over the nail. Well, wherever you're going to be placing your um, poly gel, that is. Or your rhinestones, um, my bad. Wherever you're going to be placing your rhinestones is where the, you need your poly... So now we have this much done so far. Wow. That blue, beautiful, looks beautiful. And I love the nails. This one here looks really great, but we're going to be using the Ejubus plate today. 
since I haven't used it yet. And let's see. That one was the Halloween plate. I haven't got to use it. I didn't use it yet. But anyways, I want to use their Christmas one. Has their little Christmas stuff. And then on this side. Beautiful. I love it. Alright guys, so I used Gershon's top coat and this is the mini I created. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure to hit that like button down below guys. Go ahead and subscribe if you are not subscribed to this channel. Don't forget I have a 15% off code down below in the description box from Gershon that you can use on their poly gel kit. And I have to say I absolutely love their products. Stay tuned because I will be doing a review of the Gersian dip powders pretty soon. But I hope you enjoyed it. I think it turned out super, super cute. I love you guys. Make sure to share and like and comment down below so I can reply to you guys because I always love to talk to you all. Tell me what you think of this mini. But anyways, guys, have a great day. I will make sure to link this down below for you guys as well because, um, it's really like one of my favorites, guys, really. But anyways, guys, hope you're having a blessed day, and bye.